So, DJI has officially teased the forthcoming of its second generation avatar, and looks like they are ready to roll with some massive changes for the drone. Mark the date, 11th of April it's going to be. Previously, we got a glimpse of the Avatar 2. Credit goes to an unboxing video shared all over X. And now we get the official confirmation from DJI itself, launching just in a few days. So, are you also excited like we are for the upcoming Avatar 2, and wondering what features we might get compared to the original Avatar? Well, in today's video, we will be sharing the key upgrades of DJI's upcoming FPV, and also if it's going to be worth upgrading. The first and foremost upgrade you will find is a more compact and slimmer body. The drone has been redesigned significantly, making it a more suitable flyer in congested areas. I mean, that's what Sinew Hoop drones are mainly popular for, allowing you to take breathtaking shots. This new design has also partially solved the most talked about issue of Avatar, the flyer being too noisy while flying. The leaked retail packaging suggests the Avatar 2 will also be quieter in flight than its predecessor. Well, I'm not sure how much quieter it's actually going to get though. One notable upgrade, however, is going to be the inclusion of a larger sensor. The Avatar 2 is expected to come up with a 1x1.3-inch CMOS sensor featuring 4K shooting capability. So, you get to shoot 4K videos with both drones. But the larger sensor will allow the Avatar 2 to capture more light, making portraits in low light look even more incredible. Good enough for a drone of this size, and for still images, you can capture up to 48 megapixels, which delivers quite sharp and detailed pictures. So, for those who were concerned about whether Avatar 2 could handle the payload of Gorpo Mini 12, the larger sensor eliminates the need for any external camera. You will also find the latest stabilization technology from DJI, Rocksteady 3 Plus, since there are no physical gimbal attachments. What helps more in creative shots is the Horizon Steady technology. However, there is still no hope for directional obstacle avoidance sensors, which is quite a bummer. The image shared by Quadro News shows a rear sensor though, which might come in handy. But we were hoping at least a forward-facing obstacle avoidance sensor. But so far, it seems DJI has made a streamlined design for the Avatar 2, with some necessary upgrades and making the drone more visually appealing than before. The Avatar is a solid pick for those who are looking for an entry into the world of FPV flyers, and love to explore the world from a whole new perspective. If DJI doesn't bump the price and sticks with the near around price tag of $650, the Avatar 2 will surely be a great drone to have. So, don't forget to tune in to the 11th of April to witness DJI's latest Pro FPV drone. 